Yo, hello guys and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial guys, I will be showing you how to add shipping costs to your WooCommerce products. First of all guys, I will need you to go to your WordPress and then go ahead and open the dashboard from wordpress.com slash WP admin. After that, go to plugins and click on add new. And from here guys, I will need you to search for WooCommerce. So let me just load the page. Here we go. Type here WooCommerce with double O and here it is. Now guys, all you need to do is wait until the page loads, click here to install now, and then click on the button to activate it. After that, go to install plugins, make sure that it's activated over here, and if you want in here, you will not find it deactivated. Now, when you finish with these steps, all you need to do is refresh the page, and you will notice that in this menu that you will have in the dashboard, some other things or options has been added to it. For example, WooCommerce, Products, Payments, Analytics, and Marketing. Now, let's go to Products, and let's go to our products. Now, to be able to actually add shipping uh, payments to the products, what you can do is actually go here, so Add New. Let's add a new product, so let's call it, for example, uh, Pringles X. And here I would like add an image, so add media, here we go, insert info, here we can add another image, so here it is. And basically guys, here all you need to do is actually add the price, so here we can add for example um, a price, so here we go, 15 bucks. And here I will add to the inventory, so how much left I have in the inventory, so let's add for example 20. And here the shipping. So here you can add shipping classes and by adding shipping classes are used by search, certain shipping method to group similar products. Anyway, here guys, after you put the kilograms and etc. So here for example, I put the kilograms, here you can put the dimension, etc, etc. Here you can add some linked products, attributes and here advanced. So here purchase notes, menu order, etc. And here you can get some more options. So for example, here if you want to add like any taxes, you can just get here to browse all extensions. So let's go here. And if you want to search for example tax or like uh, shipping, so let's search for shipping. Here we go. And here it is. So table rate shipping or conditional shipping and payments. Here you can just click on one of these things. So here we go. For example, this one. And you will need to actually add to cart, add it to your account and free download it. And then go here and let's publish this product and go to plugin section and start plugins here and let's wait go back here and it is pretty simple so all you need to do is click on add new so here we go and from here click on upload plug plugin so the thing that you will download from here you will just copy it and uh, upload it here and after that you will have it in this section so you can add the price of shipping over there so guys that was it for today's video if you enjoyed please leave a like and thank you guys a lot for watching